So, Daddy, <laughs> what is federalism? A system of government that creates a central government and local state governments. The powers of the national and state governments are divided and balanced. So why was federalism put into place? Because the colonies had their own government for each colony, but the colonies didn't have a government to keep them all united together. So the idea of federalism got put into action. They would have one federal government and smaller governments for each of the 13 colonies, which soon grew into the United States of America. However, there was more than just making sure there wasn't one power, like a king or parliament. The federal, the federal government couldn't tax colonists, only the states could. Of course the colonists liked it, because they would be represented in taxes. Hello, George Washington here. Not only that, but what if Great Britain came back for revenge? Would a lone colony defeat a country? No? The colonies considered each other one country, but they didn't have a federal government. What would happen if all 50 states only had governors, but no president for the United States? That's federalism. We all need federalism in our government systems, so everyone can control what goes on in their state. They have more of a say that way. Of course, federalism sounds great, but what would... But there are actually people that don't support federalism. Anti-federalists want more power to go to the federal government and less power to the states. Act Activity time. You will need a pencil and paper for the after show quiz. So, as you just learned, there are two different parts of government. What are they? Which government has more power? Why is federalism important to America? What would the colonists like federalism? Why would Do you think federalism should be used? Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you guys for teaching me about federalism. You're welcome.